Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to review a toiletry item in the food care category and it is the Avon Food Works Rough Skin Remover. So without further ado, let's get started with the product description. <laughs> So here is the product. It has a white packaging with a transparent cap. It is a squeeze tube, which is also known as the Malibu tube or Totals. It has a weight to it. It is squishy, but a little harder compared to a lotion or toothpaste. So on the front of the tube, it says, Avon foot works with the image of free feet under it below that it adds heavy skin remover so anti rugosity it is a 75 ml tube now as we flip the product oh lord it is tiny again anyways it says with regular use helps smooth and soften rough dry skin to use apply to clean dry feet leave for 60 seconds then massage in rinse off thoroughly and towel dry warning avoid contact with eyes if contact occurs immediately flush with water keep out of the reach of children then the same thing is written in several other languages and finally at the bottom we have the company details such as even beauty arabia customer care south africa and below that we have the ingredient list it also has the expiry date of 12 months once open. It has the 4 LDPE symbol. That is, this is a low density polyethylene along with 109 26 OBU, which I googled and I still don't know what that means. Beside that, we have the VA in an oval symbol, which again, no idea what does that mean. And finally, we have the Mobius loop which basically means it is recyclable. It is made in Poland, trademark Avon Cosmetic England. Now the product itself has a mint toothpaste scent. It is very refreshing. The texture is very gritty with sphere balls, almost like an exfoliator and rubbed by a thick cream. When applied, it is instantly cold, like freezing cold. I guess it is the mint in it but since that is not enough information i went online and i found the same product with the same packaging on a website called beautybulletin.com there is no further information but that however confirms that the product exists Secondly, I went on to avon.uk.com and I found a product with a similar name but with a completely different packaging and I looked into the description. It said rich cream with pumice and walnut shell to slough away rough skin. On my product, it does not mention pumice and wal walnut shell the packaging however as i dived into the ingredient list and compared it to the one i had on hand it was the same thing on the website it said ingredients aqua paraffin pumice stearic acid magnesium aluminium silicate glycerol stearate cityaryl alcohol pg40 stearate stearate minus two juglans regia shell powder Phenoxyethanol, potassium hydroxide, methyl parabol, menta piperita oil, parfum 8457518. And this is dot on what is written on my packaging. So the, it is the same product. Also, the same product is available on Amazon at five pounds sterling. <laughs> Now, I personally bought this product because I have a rough sole around the edge of my feet since I do lots of walking. 
Uh, here is a before picture. As you can understand and see, it does make the sole outer region tough, extremely dry and rough. I bought it from the Avon store in my country for about four US dollars. So I will be using this product four times a week for 14 days. I will basically apply it to clean feet like lathering it with a decent thick consistency and leave it on for 60 to 90 seconds. Afterwards, I will massage it in circular motion just like what I would do for a face exfoliation. Um, so please don't mind, my feet are clean, <laughs> yet I don't know why the camera is showing it weird. But I first started with the left foot, I applied the product and allowed it to sit for 60 seconds and it does not harden or become dry, it is almost the same consistency as before. I then massage it into my feet and rinse it off and oh my god, my left foot instantly felt so nice and it felt suppler. Then I moved on to the right foot and repeated the same process except this time the product dried and I had to massage it quite vigorously and oh my god, so many dead skin. And as I washed it off, my foot felt smooth, soft and supple immediately. It was very satisfying. However, I don't think it is just the rough skin like the dead skin coming off. It is more of a combination of the product solidifying and the skin. So first use, I felt a big difference instantly. And also, I tried to use the product again on my left foot to see if it will peel off in the same way as the right one. It did not. I guess it is about the amount of uh, dead skin you have on your feet. So yeah, that's that. And also, after almost a week of using it, I must say the rough skin started to lose its tough outline. Some of the gaps started healing. My feet felt moisturized and smoother than on the first day. Eventually, as we moved into the second and final week of trying out this product, my feet looked and felt like a different skin. It is not the same. It does have that much. It doesn't have that much rough skin. Uh, the hard and thick outline on the sole is definitely much softer, like. 70 percent better however i have to say it is more of an exfoliating product than a rough skin remover it takes a lot of efforts and time to get some results so to help you make a better choice here are the pros and cons <laughs> Number one, it is not a rough skin remover, it is more of a gentle to medium exfoliator, which leads me to believe if you have extreme flaky, tough skin, this product might not be the best option. Number two, it requires a lot of application and effort. If I had done this experiment like only two or three times a week, my results would 100% be totally different. I had to actually apply the product at least five times in the second week to see if there's any extreme change. Number one, it smells amazing and it does provide a soothing sensation to your feet and heels. Two, it is quite cheap. Three, I have used it maybe 10 times and it still feels full. So there is a lot of product left, which can definitely go for two months or so. Four, if in such a short period of time it improved my sole texture, I am pretty sure with regular daily application over the long term, this product can only be beneficial. So, will I recommend this product? 
Yes, I will definitely recommend it for people who have thick, hard and rough skin on their soul. However, they will have to put in the effort and be patient to see a big result. But it is definitely quite worth it. There's nothing wrong trying it out since I personally had such a good experience and will definitely use it again in the future. This is a great product, but you have to give it time and effort. So yeah, this is it. That's all I got for you guys for today's video. I hope you guys liked it. And if you did, do not forget to give me a big thumbs up. Click on the subscribe button and comment down below what should I try next. So yeah, bye guys. Until next, take care.